New at 10, interstate shut down. This is a live look at I-41, a portion still closed a day after record-breaking snow. Crews still cleaning up wrecked rigs after a 60-car pileup. Yes, the highway is still a mess nearly 36 hours after that massive wreck. Well, tonight crews towing away the last of four big rigs marooned in ditches. Here's the area shut down I-41 between Highway 60 and 145. Rebecca Clough is there live, and Rebecca, it does take a while to get those big semis out of the way. George and Carol, this is not as simple as just hooking up a tow truck and pulling them free. I want you to take a look at what we're working with here over here on the northbound lanes. Look at the tow trucks. There's multiple tow trucks, multiple cables all hooked to one rig that they're trying to pull out. Swing across here to the southbound lanes and you can see the interstate totally shut down. There's a crane out there. They're trying to get this semi into the upright position and they really have just pulled it up as you were starting the show from on the ground to totally upright. Drivers diverted a highway shut down for the second day in a row. Monday, the winter storm led to a massive pile up on I-41. All of a sudden it was just like you said, it just got white out and then all of a sudden it was just semis jackknifed and just cars everywhere. So. Crews spent all yesterday towing away the cars, but they couldn't get the semi trucks. Based on the weather conditions and the other traffic conditions, the highway already be shutting down for numerous hours. We determined it safest just to let them in place until it was a better time to move them out. The Sheriff's Department and State Patrol decided tonight to get the semis. They shut down the highway at 7. The crews have already been out here for hours. They first had to unload the contents of the semis, then they're flipping them upright before they can even tow them away. They are anticipating it taking at least five hours to get the trucks moved. It's a rather large operation. There's approximately 15 tow trucks between the three wrecker services that are here assisting tonight. Now they do anticipate being out here until midnight, possibly even until 1 a.m. Southbound totally shut down. As I said, northbound there is one lane closed down. So as you can see behind me, there is a bit of a slowdown at times. We've really seen uh, quite a backup over here on the northbound lane. So if you are driving in this area or know someone, please be extra cautious. For now, reporting live on I-41 in Slinger, Rebecca Clough, today's TMJ4. Good advice. Thanks, Rebecca.